I'm going to be opening up a $1, $10, $100, and a $1,000 Pokemon mystery box to see if any of them are actually worth it and which one gave me the most value. For the $1 mystery pack, we actually have an official Pokemon product, the Pokemon Halloween Trick or Treat Booster Pack. I'm very interested to see what we could possibly get in this. For the $10 mystery box, we actually found something on Amazon that was perfectly $9.99. If you get lucky with the poll, you can get over $10 in value. Maybe they'll give you a guaranteed $10 card. Probably not, but we'll find out together. For the $100 mystery box, we found something on eBay that seems more than perfect. The Pokemon Tobias mystery pack, the strongest mystery pack. Just look at this image they gave us. It's incredible. But even more exciting, if you scroll down and read the description, guaranteed at least $200 worth of cards. I don't know what to think, but I could not be more excited to get this. For the $1,000 mystery box, I once again found something on eBay. They claim that it has at least $1,000 worth of cards. It's a one of one mystery box, and the person selling it has a 100% positive feedback rating on eBay. I just couldn't pass this up, especially when I saw that that it's made by Trainer Nick, and they have a shiny Magikarp sticker. Fish. One week later. Guess what I got? Of course, we gotta start with the $1 mystery pack. Unsurprisingly, came in a little envelope. Let's open that up, and as we expected, the trick or trade pack. It is spooky season, and Gengar is looking very spooky. Hi. Okay. There we go. Ooh, we got a hollow to start. That that probably means something. Let's see? Oh. Okay, probably not worth as much. But Boo, okay, huh. I don't know what the bull rates are on these, but like you know, we got a hollow. That's not that bad. Next up is the ten dollar mystery box we got from Amazon. Came in this package. They showed a base set pack in the artwork. I'm sure this has a base set pack. Come on. Okay, it's one pack in here. Let's see. Oh, no. no. Oh, okay. It's a Grim Snarl V. It's a pretty cool card. Uh, I'll take it. It's probably not worth much. Chilling Rain. I haven't opened anything from this in a while. So let's see. Scroll of the Skies. That's a tree. Steeny. Slowpoke. Pro Brawler. Snow Run. Weedle. The cast form. I reverse trainer and Bishop failed. We'll go next time. Before we start opening the expensive stuff, I need to let you guys know that this video was only possible because of the sponsor, Raid Shadow Legends. Raid is available for PC and mobile, and it's full of millions of champion combinations, raid bosses to defeat, campaign battles, and much more. My favorite champion has to be Raglan, as there's no better reviver in the game, making it perfect to use in virtually any game mode. But when it comes to taking on bosses, I have to have Royal Guard on my team as there's no better champion for just wrecking any boss in front of me if you recently got ultimate death knight make sure you use promo code dk rises so you can get it up to level 50 and five star ascension and right now raid is running a free to enter halloween event for new players full of real life and in-game prizes which even includes thousand dollar amazon gift cards use my link or scan the qr code right here to download raid and get a free starter pack worth up to thirty dollars a free champion Virgis, and also this cool in-game loot you will find these rewards here in your inbox for the next 30 days only all right this is where things get fun now it's time for the 100 dollars mystery box the tobias mystery pack that's guaranteed to be worth 200 dollars came in this here it goes ignore that it's upside down Okay, this thing is really taped up, which probably means there's a lot of value in here, right? Ooh, all right, we're seeing an EX at the top, a Japanese card, that's pretty cool. Okay, so it looks like there are no packs in here, it's just cards, which is kind of exciting, it's a little bit different. Genuinely no idea what to expect, let's just try and go through these. Magirna EX, ah, Buzzwool. Entei Reverse, Pikachu Reverse, Hey, that's a trap inch from a third gen set. Um, when they're like the different typings. Delta species, that's cool. Uh, Raichu V. Berserker V. I, 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 there we go. Ooh. Alternate art, Gardevoir, that's pretty cool. Alolan Persian GX, oh, I forgot about GX cards. Duraludon V. Delphox V. Inaramis V. Mimikyu V. Entei V. Yo, it's a, it's a $4 card, apparently. It's an older card. I like that. 
It's a $3 mug. Ooh, Greninja. I'll take any frog I can get. That's pretty cool. Hey, Giratina, the blue cards from back in the day. That is a regular Squirtle. A Celagor, the blue cards from Gen 5. Gen 5 Hollow, okay. Hey, that's a Gen 4 card. I'll take that. Tornadus. Thunderous. Landris, okay, they gave us the trio, which is actually, I do appreciate that. Ooh, little Magnemite, uh, like, ooh, two alternate arts. Pikachu alternate art, I'll take that. <laughs> $1 Bastiodon, $4 Crobat, but hey, hey, this is a Delta Species, and Delta Species cards are incredibly cool, so I'll take this any day. Yo, Radiant Sneasler and Radiant Gardevoir. Wait, what's this? Yo, wait, wait, why are these cards all stuck together? Hey, yo. The Drapion rainbow v star that's sick wow next to the guard war this is actually pretty cool Glade over here okay so this is in a top loader a champ v max i actually have a lot of those look oh my god wait that's just an alternate art that's incredibly cool okay look at this an older hollow electrode snorlax uh, Magneton, when's this from? All right, 2019 Magneton, that's kind of cool. Ultra Necrozma, Reverse, Rosa Hollow. Ooh, alternate art, Weavile's very cool. Delphox, all right, that's a full art V, that's cool. Special Energy, Dragon, Sableye. Ooh, I love that art. Ooh, Eternatus VMAX is kind of sweet. The Hisuian Samurott V-Star, Gengar V. Vile Plume GX. Ooh, I love this art. Two dollar Vaynet from back in the day. Sure. Four dollar Swalot Grass Card Hollow. Uh, Japanese V Max Kiram. Yo! Wait, two gold cards too. Yo! Oh my God, this is actually so sick. I can't believe this is actually maybe worth it. I Aerodactyl V, Porygon Z Hollow, Garchomp Hollow, Dusk Noir. Uh, Dust Tox, Reverse, Arcanine, Zekrom, Solgaleo, GX, and then Guzzlord. This was 71 cards. If these cards are all worth a little over a dollar, this is going to have been worth it. And multiple of these cards were older and already worth a few dollars by the little sticker. Now what we've all been waiting for, the thousand dollar mystery box. Alrighty. There's a note that says, open bubble wrapped items first, then follow notes. So there's gonna be a bunch of notes in this and I'm very excited. Everything's numbered. This is gonna be like a fun little game. Okay. This is seven. These two little guys on top. Eight, two, a bubble wrapped thing. Last, four, five. Ooh, oh wow. Okay, so elite trainer box. All right, so. My leg. That's the box. Let's get the bubble wrap stuff in front. We'll open that first, then we'll get to the notes. The note said nothing about these two little guys. So we're just gonna open them up first. Oh, there's multiple packs in here. I don't actually know if I've ever opened up this set before so this is kind of fun reverse helioptile kind of like that art and not a rebel clash nose pass and then nothing all right two more packs milsery meditite magic carpets fish yeah look at that yeah it was worth it now all right yeah but come on look at this fish oh that's a cool one yo a freaking rainbow Frog starter. We haven't even gotten to the bubble wrapped stuff yet. That was just the two little tins on top. So here's the three sealed things we got, at least in the bubble wrap. Ooh, look at this. The Charizard starter deck. I actually might just keep these sealed. All right, yeah, look at these. Yeah, so we got these two, which is pretty cool. But the one I'm most excited about is like this. I don't know, I feel like a Charizard starter deck, you hold onto it long enough. It gets cooler and cooler with age. Sun and Moon, GX. Oh, GX, challenge box. I haven't opened cards with GX in it for a while, so that's kind of cool. All right, starting off, we got the Decidueye starter deck. So I have four more starter decks now than, than I've really ever had. Two Decidueyes from the box. So we got those. And then two of the uh, the base set Sun and Moon packs. All right, Bruxious and hey, we got an Incineroar GX. Look at that. That's pretty cool. Cosmog. Rare Candy. I think Rare Candies are actually like useful cards. So that's pretty cool. Reverse and... All right, well, and now the elite trader box. Okay, this guy's gonna have a decent amount of packs in it, so I'll try to go quick. This is a lot of packs. Ooh, reverse five Brava and a hollow research. Dene and a hey! full art Zamazenta V. Carablast and Braylon. Oh, I love this reverse. That's very cool. 
Hi, Ice Cube. Sock. And then, hey, okay. Uh, hollow Infernape. Yo! Alternate Art Dust Noir. That is very cool. And hey, this isn't even the hit. And then, hey, more Pico, the Hangry Mode. I will absolutely take that. Nice. Uh, Star Raptor. Oh, I think that's a reverse rare. That's cool. Halucha Reverse. And uh, nothing. Diamond Weavile and Ice Cube. Reverse Clink and. Ah! But now it's on to the little packages. I'm so happy these things are numbered. It makes my life so much easier. Okay. A lot of random cards. So we got the, the Moltres promo and then it's just a bunch of energies. Oh, wait, no, is this like a, a deck? We got the promo Moltres, but then this is like a, a full deck. Right, so this is a little thing from 2016. That's very cool. Two more of these little packages from 2016. Evolving Skies little package. A Lipard Brilliant Stars little package. All right, cool. Those were the little like deck packages. I don't know the 2016 ones because they're a little bit farther back, but package one also came with this bundle, which just seems to be a bunch of like singular cool cards. We got the Dusk Noir alternate art. Yo! Oh, that's a Steelix. I think, what is it, Prime? Oh my God, Radiant Eevee. I actually never got one of these. Oh, actually, it's the promo. Oops! Wait, and there's multiple cards on each side? Oh my God! Wait, these are two-sided. The um, the Dust Snore has a, a Grim Snarl shiny. Look at that. And then the, the Steelix had this. So this has Ariados. We have a Dedene there, and then... <laughs> that man's an imposter. That man is the imposter. Octillery, uh, full art, which is cool. Yo, and then a Japanese rainbow Machamp in Marshadow. I love this. Let's go. This is just a singular card. Alternate art Houndoom from Single Strike. I really like this. That's cool. Finally, we have the Hoot Hoot alternate art and... Uh, Japanese alternate art. Look at that. Package number two time. Let me know if you guys want more of these videos or if there's any way to improve them because like, this is cool. Number two, let's see what's in here. Oh, it's graded cards. I don't have many graded cards in my collection, but the first one. Hey, it's a Golurk V. All right, well, Golurk is one of my fiance's favorite Pokemon. It's a 10. Okay, and this is? Hey, Arctivish. It's a 10. They're both 10s. All right. Neither of these cards are super exciting, but it is really cool to have cards that are graded as a 10. So number three, we still got a bunch of these. <laughs> hey, it's just a bunch of packs. Let's start with Vivid Voltage. Stun Fisk and then, hey, it's a hollow. Onto some Fusion Strike. Uh, you and then I. All right, Reverse Energy and nothing. All right. Okay, we got a few Shining Fates. I'm ready to get my Shiny Charizard. Reverse Star Tricks and Boss's Ord. Reverse Rallets and okay. Not a good start for Shining Fates, but we got one more. Trap Inch. Okay. That was disappointing, I'll be honest. On to Darkness Ablaze. Reverse Furrets and A. Hey, okay, Hollow Heatran. That's kind of cool. I'll take that. Shelmets. Reverse Hippotas and A. Hey, Eternatus V Max. I actually think we got this card in the $100 mystery box, but now we've gotten it and we've pulled Ooh, it. Ooh, Reverse Kangaskhan. That's actually pretty cool. Reverse and. <gasps> Ooh, Reverse Arctazil and. Yo! A full art Butterfree V Max. I will take that. Finally, some Chilling Rain. Reverse Amphros. Think that's rare. And I Pissimia. Lapras. All right, reverse Caitlyn. Hey, Galarian Slowking VMAX. Old Cemetery and Skullaby. Galarian Slowpoke. Reverse Passimian. That's a rare. And okay, Hollow Cresselia. On to package four. And this one's pretty interesting. It's it's a very square package. Right, package number four is random cards, maybe? Right, I don't I don't know what this is. Where are the, oh, it's the Happy Meals. Oh, it is the Happy Meal packs. Oh, look at that. Hi, this is a sealed 25th anniversary pack. It has stickers. <laughs> I have so many cards to open. I think I'm going to keep these two the way they are just because they're probably worth a little bit more this way. Package number five. Oh, what is this? Wait, it's a mystery box in a mystery box. <laughs> Look for randomly inserted vintage packs, three booster packs plus one online code. All right, we're really going to find out if mystery boxes are good. Let's see the packs. Battle Styles, Darkness Ablaze, Vivage Voltage. Okay, they're all Sword and Shield. This was absolutely a ripoff. I don't think we've opened Battle Styles today, so let's just see what's in here. Mr. Mime, Ball Toy, Mienfu. Reverse Carnivine. Hey, okay, failing. I'm gonna get Rainbow Chonkachu. Just wait. Uh, Puchiena. 
You. Oh, oh my God, it is a rainbow. We actually got a rainbow pole. Good luck following that up. Terra blast and I, I got a good feeling about number six. I, interesting. So, ooh, a sealed Japanese pack. I haven't opened Japanese cards in a really long time. Oh, some Detective Pikachu packs. Let's get through the less exciting packs first, then we'll move on to the, the Detective Pikachu and the Japanese pack. Some Sun and Moon. Ooh, Reverse and Cinder is kind of sick. And I, hey, look at that. Uh, reverse you and hey, Lorantis GX. It's a hit, I'll take it. All right, Crimson Invasion. Cubone, hey, Reverse Melodic. That's actually pretty cool, I'll take that. And? All right, well, I like the reverse pattern back in the day. That's pretty cool. Sun and Moon, Burning Shadows, Noibats, Grimer, Rayolu. Ooh, reverse Valimar looks pretty cool and Shenotic. Part of me really wants to save these. The other part of me wants to pull a Charizard. Let's do it. Psyduck, Charmander, Bulbasaur, Slay King. All right, this one, this one's the pack. This one's the pack. Lickitung, Psyduck. Morlo? Here we go again. Probably shouldn't have opened those. I love the packaging this is in, and it's just giving me faith that this is just the rarest pack of rare packs, and it has the best cards I've ever done seen. I haven't opened Japanese cards in a really long time. So, bye, Bravo. Uh, Cedra. Swablu. Oh. I feel like I should have kept all of those things sealed. <laughs> it's lucky number seven time. Bum, 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 bum. Ooh, we got X and Y Steam Siege. Some more Steam Siege. X and Y Evolutions. Another Evolutions. Shining Legends. I've never opened one of these packs before. And then- Sure, another uh, Japanese pack. We didn't get a Shiny and Shining Fate, so let's see what we can get here. Ekans, Zora. Shroomish and Hi. I would like to get one shiny pull. Who will fish? A reverse Pikachu. I'll take that. And okay. Wasn't meant to be because we're getting Charizard in these. Dugong. Wow, this is so nostalgic. De evolution. Metapod. Weedle. Machop. Pikachu. Magnemite. Ponyta, reverse Pokedex. How did I mess that up? Oh, <laughs> it was only three. Dugong was the rare. I right. reverse Onyx and oh my God, I love this. Hollow Gyarados. I'll take this. I love that art. Ugh. I've never opened a pop series pack ever. Here goes everything. Let's uh get rid of this pack's value immediately. No idea what to expect. So just you. And hey, probably shouldn't have opened that one either. Let's see what's here. You just gotta love the back of Japanese cards. It's so much cooler than the American cards. Little Stunfisk, Vulpix. That's a cat. That's a scary ring. You're a person. <gasps> Hair. Okay, Hollow U. Hollow U. Hey, GXU, that's pretty sick. And we got two Steam Siege. I did the pack trick wrong again, so that's the rare. Reverse Mankey. Yo, is that a shiny Steelix? That's shiny Mega Steelix, dude. I didn't even know that was a poll. This might be my favorite poll so far today. Time for number eight. Oh, are these graded cards? Oh, these are graded cards. 8.5. Hey, Flareon EX, back from like the, the Eevee packs. I remember what these packs were back in the day, but someday, I mean, it's not like this is going to be worth a ton, but it's definitely a, a cool little collector's thing. Oh, these next two are PSA. I don't really know if PSA is like the best grading. It's just the one I know the most about, so. Ooh, Camerupt EX, wait a minute. My brain lagged. I was looking at the nine. Oh my God. Third gen EX card, mint nine. This is actually so cool. I can't we got something this cool. One more PSA. Oh my God. I hope it's like half as cool as that last one. I, okay. It is near mints, mints, eight Pikachu. 2004 hollow Pikachu. Wait a minute. Oh my God. My fiance is going to love this card. That was a cool pack, but my expectations are very high. I am interested. I am excited. I am nervous. Last. Okay. Okay. It's packs. This is so cool. All right, this, a lot of nostalgia here. Let's open this first. All right, one, two, three, maybe? I don't know the pack trick. I'm just assuming it's three. Gotharita, Cryogonal. Oh my God, this is nostalgic. Pikachu, nice. Uh, Veneery, Energy Search, Ducklet, Venipede. 
I reverse and then just a regular grumpig. I can say with confidence I have never opened a pack like this before. Wait, well, the first card was the hollow. I love this card. It is one of my favorite cards. It is so simple. This was the set when I started collecting. I got fossil first, and then me and my cousin got a bunch of jungle. I have all of these cards like the like back in the day. But now I've pulled a hollow scyther. I don't know if that was worth a thousand dollars yet, but I'm definitely not disappointed, and that's what matters.